But now we're going to move on to our India Abroad Lifetime Achievement Award. And I'm going to ask our three previous winners who are here tonight to join me on stage to present these awards. Please welcome Padma Desai, Jagdish Bhagwati, and Salman Rushdie. Ladies and gentlemen, the maestro, Zubin Mehta. And today, we honor with the India Abroad Award for Lifetime Achievement. Ladies and gentlemen, I stand here very proud amongst my countrymen. And I cannot help but remind you that Sachin Tendulkar scored 160 today. <laughs> Or New Zealand ko mar dalega. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I've been in this country for a long time. I'm very grateful to be welcomed here. I met my wife here. My home, my official tax home is in California. But Indian is Indian. And when I started here in 1960, I was a lonely person in America. Today, when we see and we hear about the success of our people emigrated to this great country and what they are doing, and you saw the younger generation today, spelling and mathematics and doctors, and I mean, the ambition, and the nurturing of these young people by their parents that we have to be so proud of. I'm not lonely anymore. You cannot go to a hospital, a university, where you don't find the superstars from the subcontinent. I'm very happy about all this. And it's in all their names that this lifetime has come. Thank you. Um, Maestro, one of the things you were complaining about was you were wor very worried about the acoustics here tonight. So you're always on. Yeah, well, I wouldn't play a concert in this hall. <laughs> <laughs> but it's very beautiful, I must say. It's a discovery for us to be here tonight. And Bravo. you've been in New York for so many years and had not no, a chance, never been so here. this is great. 